There you go, little noodle. Come on. Bring your head up and let's go over here. All right, help me. Help me, hummingbird. Hummingbird, why are you not helping me? There we go. Jesus. What's going on, guys? Dragas here, and welcome to Snake Pass. This was just released today on uh, Steam as well as all the other console platforms, and I am so excited for it. This is a new adventure game where you portray a snake called Noodle uh, that you can see on the screen right now, and you have to go do slithery-like things around different worlds. So it looks really exciting. I actually was lucky enough to play it at PAX. It was my second favorite game from PAX, so obviously I'm really excited to be getting into it today. Noodle! Alright, clearly he is looking for me. Shit has hit the fans! I actually don't know the storyline for this game, by the way. We weren't shown that in packs, so... Uh, we're probably gonna find something out here. Wake up, I'm waking up. Give me a second here. The gate! The gate is broken! Noodle's still waking up! He probably isn't processing this. If we don't fix it, we'll be stuck here forever. Okay, so we gotta go fix the gate with little old Noodle, and this is Noodle right here. Uh, now, this game's got a really cool, obviously, slither mechanic, uh, where you gotta utilize being a snake to get to a lot of parts of the map. So, yeah, we're just gonna have a fun time here, seeing how far we can get, and uh, trying to play with Noodle here. Now, with Noodle, you actually do need to slither to move. Uh, if you do move straight forward, obviously, the snake's not gonna go very fast. So, uh, I'm seeing... Down here, it looks like we got, uh, maybe there's something hidden down there. So I'm gonna try and use my noodley school skills to actually get down there. And bear with me here, it's gonna take a little while to get used to this again. Uh, this game is actually very difficult to do. There we go. Okay, so you wanna wrap around, obviously, so we don't fall down. Oh god, oh god, okay, we, we, we fell down. Alright, that wasn't bad for a first try, though. Uh, this stuff usually isn't probably meant to be grabbed this early into the game. It is <laughs> so damn cool, though to be a snake in a game. All right, let's wrap around this pole now that we got there. There we go. Come on, little noodle. Wiggle it. Oh, I'm actually kind of stuck on my body right now, but I am obviously really stuck on this pole as well. There we go. Okay, we're gonna wrap around that pole, and now we should be able to go down and grab the coin, yes! All right, getting my snake skills on already. Oh, oh, oh God, okay. I, okay, hopefully I keep that coin because there's no way I'm doing that again. Okay, we're back at it. You actually don't keep the coin, so I figured, you know what, we may as well do this right here and try and actually grab all the coins, at least for the first level here. I'm not pretty, I'm not really that big of a, an achievement hunter, you know, trying to get all the things, but uh, I did want to show you how Noodle works, so a lot of that is going to happen, a lot of those mechanics where you got to get up to certain places, you're utilizing your snake-like appendages. Or rather, appendage. I guess snakes don't have appendages. Uh, pick up speed. I don't know what it said there. It's, I, I'm assuming I just got to pick up speed, though. So, all right. So, we're kind of in a tutorial right now. Uh, but this is so cool. I, I'm just so excited for this game. It gives me a really big... Uh, you guys probably aren't even going to know what this game is. But Spyro vibe. Uh, back in the day, there was a PlayStation 1 game. Uh, I mean, it, it was a dragon, there was nothing snake-like, it just, it feels like it, it looks like it, I guess it looks kind of like Banjo-Kazooie as well. It just reminds me a lot of the old, you know, awesome platformer games. Alright, so here we go, we gotta go over these things, you know what, let's just uh, do a little bit of a speed run here, I'm doing pretty good so far. Alright, there we go, we got those ones, and it looks like we need to go get the purple stone to unlock the portal, which I can see right to the right of us. A keystone is missing from the gate. Yes, my assumption was correct. We need to find the keystone and bring it back. I wonder where it is, little hummingbird. I forget this guy's name, by the way. Now, I know my name's Noodle. I think his name kind of rhymes with it. It's Zoodle or something like that. We'll probably find out in a very short while here. Uh, is there anything else? Can I get any more secrets, though, before we try and get this? It's looking like there's not much else on this map, so let's go this way. All right, they need this gem, so we'll go grab it, and there we go. Holy crap, Hummingbird. Relax, bro. Made me dizzy there, Jesus. All right, so we got all the gems. I'm assuming we can go... Ooh. Oh, oh, the wait. The Hummingbird has to put it in first. Oh, there's actually a thing over there I'm gonna grab first. Okay, so good thing I noticed that. Oh, there's also a coin. All right, all these other things I didn't see before. 
All right, so we got this thing. We need to grab all of these. Oh, still, okay, I did get them all. Sweet. Now, the coins are supposed to be pretty hard to find, I believe, so I don't know if we'll get all the coins, but we should at least... Oh, come on, come on. Oh, oh. All right, got to try again. All right, there we go. Now we're making our way, and the problem is we need to get back. Oh, 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 all right, we're going to go this way. We only got three out of five. Wow, there was two more around there? I, I wasn't really looking for them, but uh, I didn't see any of them. Anyways, we're going to go in here. We're, we're, we're not going to get all the coins. We're going to try and get most of them, though. There we go. Paradise Path. We got all the gems, at least, and three of the coins, so not so bad. All right, let's continue on and uh, go to greener pastures here. So we're at two now. Courtyard Clamber. All right, there's the hummingbird again, and there is me, Mr. Noodle. Uh, looks like something here doesn't feel quite right. Looks quite beautiful. Uh, we should make sure that the gate is okay. Okay. Uh, I'm going to assume it isn't because I can see three gems on the map. All right, so all three gems that we need to get are over there. So right now we just need to focus on grabbing some of these blue orbs and uh, looking for any coins. So this one should be easy right there. Uh, they're going to get progressively harder, though. All right, Noodle. There you go, buddy. Good job. Let's go. Ooh, I know there's going to be so many secrets in this game, and I really want to find all of them. Uh, I guess we're just going to have to go up here right now. I don't think there's any other ones around. All right. Oh, I was trying to wrap around that. That did not work, though. All right. There we go. Come on. Wrap your head around. And yes. By, by, by the way, your body does grip. You have to utilize gripping. You can actually see uh, his muscles grip. You can also do that. You can lift the tail with the hummingbird, which will help you get across platforms, I think. Uh, there's just a lot of very awesome snake-like mechanics with this thing. All right. Come on. Let's just get up there. There we go. We didn't even need to utilize those. We just got the pull to get all the way up. Uh, I don't think there's anything up there. I think we should go look just in case, though, if we can. Any any hidden coins back here? It doesn't look like it. All right, so we're going to keep going here and uh, try not to fall off the ledge. Oh, God. All right, kind of falling off, a little scared. Wrap yourself around bamboo to climb up. We've already done this a couple times, game, but thank you for letting me know about that just in case I didn't until now. All right, so let's do that. There we go. Just keep wrapping myself. Oh, oh, grip a little bit, grip a little bit, and there we go. We are up. Now I just need to go and grab that. Yeah, there we go. Actually, also, I was rem I remember you can actually make faces with little noodle here too. So let's see. Uh, you can make him a little happier, a little sadder. Oh yeah, there we go. That's definitely me though. Uh, you can make him. Uh, what does this do? Oh, scared and angry. <laughs> He's so cute. All right, we're, we're going to do the big old happy open mouth. There we go. And one of the developers taught me how to do something. So if you spin like this, you can actually kind of get them to go upwards like that. There we go. And you can get up to higher places quite easily. So thank you, whoever that developer was at PAX. I appreciate your uh, support in helping me learn how to do snake-like moves. It's pretty awesome. Okay, little hummingbirds waiting over here. Uh, usually he actually shows you the ways to go. I know there's got to be something up there, though. Oh, there's actually something down here. Look at all the secrets we're finding. All right, so we're going to go through here. Uh, maybe over here we could actually get up somehow. Oh, yeah, there's some uh, bamboo over on this side. And now we're missing all three of the stones. <laughs> just our luck, little hummingbird. Just our luck. All right, so obviously we need to find all three keystones. I do see them around the map here, so we're going to have some fun trying to collect pretty much everything here. First of all, I wanted to go up this bamboo, but uh, let's try and go out. Oh, God. Oh, damn it. Okay, I didn't realize it was this far down. All right, come on. There we go. Got that one. Get this one, Noodle. We need to find them all, buddy. Oh, don't, don't, don't get trapped in there. All right, so now... Oh, actually, let's go into the water here because I think you go faster... Oh, yeah, you move way faster in the water. This is awesome. I love how he's holding his breath, too. Noodle is such an adorable character. All right, Noodle, get that one. There we go. Uh, there's another one over here. I guess we may as well get the, all the ones in the water right now because I don't plan on being in here for very long. All right, come on, get up. Yep, there we go. And perfect. And back to doing some climbing with good old Noodle. There you go, buddy. Oh, he's he's got the moves. I got this down. All right, there we go, there we go. I'm, I'm not even gripping right now, which makes it much faster, but much more dangerous. So there we go. Uh, how the heck am I going to get this one, though? I can probably... Oh, may, may, maybe I can grip it? Come on. I'm so close. Come on, little noodle. There we go. We got it. And, oh, there's a coin up there. You know I got to go try and do that. 
All right, Noodle. This is going to be our probably our hardest one yet because these things are on an angle. But if we just keep wrapping ourselves around in our snake-like ways... There we go. Come on. Just got to drop my head down and underneath this pole. No, no, no. Wrong way, Noodle. Ah, so close. All right. There we go. Now we're making our way. Oh, God. Oh, this is... I didn't expect to even do this, but okay. Uh, as long as we can... <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. We just went out on a little bit of a tour there. No big deal. All right. Wrap around. And, oh, oh, Noodle, Noodle, we're so close, yes, we got one at least, oh my god, that was rough, look at it from up here though, Noodle, it's beautiful, okay, well, I don't know what's the best way to get down, but I should probably look around and see where I need to go, so we got yellow over there, you know what, let's just go, uh, there's a blue thing right here, so let's try and land, yeah, right on it, perfect. Let's go get some of these main gems. Uh, we're just going to get the blue things along the way, but uh, there is the yellow one. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Why, why are you telling me this? I'm actually falling because of it. No, hummingbird, you killed Noodle. Come on, come on, Noodle. We're still here. We're still here. Okay, no, we're not. Uh, <laughs> his little yell when he falls is adorable. There we go. Now we made it up, Noodle, and this one looks like it's missing the, one of the keystones. I'll put it back in place. Uh, what? Okay. Didn't really understand that, but uh, the hummingbird now is doing his thing, so I got that one. Uh, maybe I can make this jump. All right, let's try it. Here we go. Come on, Noodle. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> oh, man, this game just feels great. Use LT to hold on tight and wrap around. So, yeah, I already know how to do this. I've been doing it all the time here. I'm, I'd actually be amazed if a kid did it without wrapping around uh, beforehand. Okay, there we go. So we got that one, and where's the final one? I thought it was over here. Okay, there's a there's a little gem up here or a coin, so let's go get that. There we go. Didn't even need to use that bamboo for that one. All right, the final one's actually back on the mainland, so we can go down here and get back down to it. Uh, looks like we got... Okay, yeah, we missed some of the orbs over here as well, so this is good. We're going over here. And get on that handrail, because we need to get that one. All right. Uh, oh, there's actually another coin right here, too. There's coins everywhere, man. There's The thing with this game is there's so many things you can collect if you want to. Ah, uh, yeah, it's telling me how to do that. I know how to do that. Uh, we're just going to go over here real quick first, because I think I can jump down to it if I go up here and get this coin. <laughs> Come on, little noodle. We can do this. This one's actually really difficult to get up. All right, we're going to wrap around again. Let's not grip it, and let's just maybe try and do the spin thing. That's not working either. Oh, oh, come on, Noodle. You don't even need that thing. There we go. I just had to get my head up there. Oh, man, this is rough, though. I'm trying to drag my whole body up, and it's just weighing me down. All right, so now that we're up here, I should be able to kind of jump across here and get the coin. Yes, there we go. That was much easier. All right, so that's almost everything on the map. We still got a bunch of the coins we need to get. Uh, I think there's maybe one up here. I know there's something up here, so we're going to go up. Because I haven't gotten anything up here yet. So there we go. Let's wrap around that. And don't want to fall. Don't want to fall. Ooh, ooh. Okay, grip it. Grip it. Grip it. <laughs> oh, Noodle, that was close. All right, slow and steady truly does win the race in this game. Because one screw up and you're going to fall all the way down. So there we go. We made it up. Grab that little noodle. And, oh, we're missing one. Where is it? I gotta find it. Actually, I don't need to find it, but I was hoping I could easily see it here. All right, we're gonna go for a quick slither around. If we don't see it, we'll move on. Uh, because it's no big deal if we don't get them all. But, uh, I do want to try and do most of this game for you guys. Oh, look at that. I found at least one of the coins. So, oh, 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 wrap around. Wrap, oh, God. Oh, God, this is horrifying. No, get up! Get up! Come on, wrap around yourself! Oh, no! <laughs> no. Oh, some of these are really rough to do. Are you serious? That actually reset literally all of my progression. So I need to go back and collect everything now. Now I know, don't die without hitting a checkpoint plate. Jesus. All right, so I collected everything again. I still don't know where that one gem is, but we're just going to... uh. Move on to the next map, because I didn't realize that, so hitting those checkpoints is a real strategy. If you didn't notice, uh, I don't even know if I'll put it in the recording, but there was a pressure plate where if you hit that, it serves as a checkpoint. So you probably want to do that at the end when you're looking for, you know, the final few pieces that you need to find. That way you don't 
you know, go all the way back to where I was uh, when you do die. Oh, okay, and then the other one wasn't bright like that, but there we go. We got that one done, and uh, yes, as, uh, as suspected, we unfortunately missed one of the blue things and two of the coins once again, so that's not too bad. All right, let's move on to level three, Gatekeeper Garden. So how this game works, there's supposed to be, you know, wind, water, fire, and earth map. So uh, basically it looks like we're in kind of the earth map right now, uh, but I was playing a lot of the other maps as well, and there was like wind mechanics and everything. Uh, oh, speaking of the devil, look at that. All right, we're gonna have some wind mechanics in this one, I guess. Oh, oh, it got real dark here, man. <laughs> what was that? I, I I agree, little hummingbird. It removed the keystones and closed the gate. We have to reopen it. This is going to be a common occurrence, by the way, having to reopen the gate before we leave. There's, oh, I, I, feel, I feel like there's definitely some secrets on the side of the walls here. Actually, doesn't really look like it. It's hard to tell. Yeah, I can't really see it, but I don't think there is. So let's keep moving forward here and uh, once again do some more climbing. So yeah, I was, I was just gonna say, you know, all the levels are not, you know, very, very similar. These levels are very similar because they're on the same world. So if you are curious, there's gonna be different levels later on. There we go. Ah, oh, that's the pressure pad I was talking about that's a checkpoint. I shouldn't have hit that. All right, this is, uh, I don't know what's up here. I didn't actually look, but obviously if there's ways to get up, then there's something up here. Oh, there's a coin. Look at that. Okay, let's get, come on, get up there. You know what? Help me with my tail, bro. There we go. Thanks, man. That, that is way more easy. Okay, the question is, do I need to wrap around or can I maybe slither all the way? Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, probably should have wrapped around. Oh, God damn it. All right, so we learn from our mistakes this time. Oh, God. Oh, man, this is actually... Oh, okay, there we go. Wrap around and grab it. Perfect. Let's try... Oh, I was going to try and grab the green square as well, but I couldn't make it far enough. So we'll go up here. Oh, this is an easy coin. That never happens. All right, there's just so much you can explore. There's a slide down there. Uh, yeah, I actually did play this map at PAX, so uh, this one is a really cool one. We need to actually climb this to get up to the slide, so of course I want to go down that slide. Uh, let's see if we can maybe utilize these things. Oh my god, this is so cool, man. And I, I'm quickly realizing how hard this game's gonna get, and it's going to be absolutely awesome. Come on, come on, little noodle. There we go. Okay, now, now we need to grip a little bit. Ah, oh, look at that! I did it! And we got a checkpoint up here, too. So, ooh, we can go down that way, too, but you know what? I'm going down the slide. Screw that thing. Alright, just get your little head in there, Noodle. We're going on a little adventure, and down the slide we go. That is so adorable. Alright, and now we need to grab this one. Never a day off for good old Noodle. Alright, there's another one over here. I'm seeing a secret entrance onto the other side over here. Ah, oh, there's so many little secret caves and everything. Uh, okay, is this a dead end? I'm assuming so, so I guess we gotta go back. We need to get old yellow up here, so let's start climbing this bamboo pole. There we go. Just gotta slide my head through these things. Uh, do I wanna go for the middle thing? Yeah, you know what? Screw it. We can do this. We, 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 we got it. Come on. Hold on to it, Noodle. Ah, all right. Well, we probably would've had to restart more or less anyways. There you go, little Noodle. Come on. Bring your head up, and let's go over here. All right, help me. Help me, hummingbird. Hummingbird, why are you not helping me? There <laughs> He was too busy grabbing the other thing, and he wouldn't pick up my tail. Oh, we found another coin, too. We're doing good on this one. All right, you can let go now, buddy. Thanks for your help. Oh, this 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 combo of a hummingbird and noodle is just great. All right, let's grab this one. I don't think we've been down. No, we haven't been down into the deep depths, so we'll grab that. And we need to go to the other side of the slide as well, because there was a coin over there. I mean, there's coins everywhere. Why is the... Okay, camera, I, I, I appreciate that you're that close, but I don't need it that close. All right, I think this is the other side of the slide, so up here... Yeah, we need, we need to go up, because there's one thing up there. And there it is, right there, so let's get up this one. There you go. Yeah, not, not, not even needing to wrap myself like a pro. And of course we're going down the slide again. Uh, because it's probably the quickest way to get back to the main part of the map anyways. Problem is, you can't slither in the slide, so it takes forever to actually get going, but there we go. And <laughs> into the water once again. That's awesome. 
All right, we're doing pretty good now. So we got the green one there. There's still a few blue balls around. I don't even know how many more I need, so we'll probably need to figure that out now. Let's try and grab onto this. There we go. And come on, get up there, little noodle. Oh, we're going to have to restart. I probably should have gripped there a little bit more. There we go. All right, there we go. That's all the gems. And oh, we still got three. Oh, man. All right, once again, I'm going to do a quick check. Uh, but we might be missing some of them, unfortunately. Uh, some of these are hidden very, very well. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, so I did find one hiding behind a rock. Uh, well, that's a good start. So there's going to be a few that are obviously quite hidden here. I uh, don't really know where the other ones are. Tighten your grip by holding LT. Thanks for letting me know for the 15th time. All right, guys, I quickly took a skim around and I couldn't find the last two gems. So we're going to move on here. Uh, you know what? If you guys, you know, let me know in the comments below if you want to see a perfect run. Maybe we'll attempt to go back and do all of these. Uh, if not, we're just going to keep going and do as much as we can. Actually, I did notice a coin there, so that's a good thing I saw that. Because we're going to try and grab that before we go here. Okay, there's just a coin on this right here. The question is, how the heck? I'm going to have to jump down, aren't I? Okay, I think, I think I need to go up to the slide part again and jump down on top of it. All right, and yes, right over here is the coin. So if we kind of fly... Wait, did I see a gem? Please don't tell me there was a gem up there I didn't even notice. Oh, what is that? There's something up there. All right, let's go check again. Were my eyes lying to me? No, they weren't. There's another one. Okay, so best way to get this. This is actually... Oh, God. This is really high up, so I'm going to have to do this well. Come on, come on, man. All right, grip it, grip it, and go, go, yes, there we go, and flying right down to the point. So we missed one again. I'm totally fine with missing one. You know, you're, you're not going to be able to get them all very easily, but there we go. Level three complete. That felt really good, man. This game is adorable. And how many coins did I get? I forget, actually. We missed one coin that time, so technically that was our best run yet. Not too bad. All right, guys. Well, that's going to wrap it up for the first episode of Snake Pass. I hope you guys enjoyed the first three levels of the game. If you guys are enjoying this, feel free to hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, and yeah, let me know if you guys do want me to focus on, you know, just trying to get through as many levels as possible. Or if you want to see, you know, a complete completionist aspect. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys, and I will see you in the next one.